So it's Phil Bedford here, the Rebel Network, and welcome to this week's show. And today, I'm privileged again to have uh, Dr. Marshall Goldsmith. And uh, Dr. Goldsmith's here in Dubai with the uh, right selection again. Dr. Smith, Goldsmith, welcome. Thank you. Back again. Always a privilege. Thank you for asking me. Um, what I do I'd like to do today for the show is, I think it's one of the, one of the things we work on with the Referral Institute is really how do we select the people to surround ourselves with mm -hmm. that have the right mindsets, the right positive attitude, the right reciprocal way of working to increase our business and our quality of life. Mm -hmm. What would be your tip on choosing the right people? Well, uh, one thing I do is really focus on getting people to take personal responsibility for their own lives. Everything in the area of employee engagement has been focused on what can the company do to engage me as opposed to you're responsible for your own life. In fact, my daughter and I have done some fascinating research. People who are miserable at work tend to be miserable at home. They're just miserable people, right? So one thing I do is I encourage people to test themselves every day on six basic questions. Every question starts with, did I do my best to? Number one, set clear goals. Number two, make progress toward achieving my goals. Number three, find meaning. Number four, be happy. Number five, build positive relationships. And number six, then, be fully engaged. So you really want to get people who are going to do their best to achieve these goals without waiting for the corporation or the network to provide something for them, to give them meaning, to make them happy. The, the more you can recruit people that do their best to achieve these goals on their own, the better partners they're going to be. Good one. Okay, and there's something that you just said on stage there, which I really like to say, I think uh, there's the title of your new book, Trigger? Triggers. And um, it was, it, I mean, this, we all get triggered. You know, somebody says or does something, we smell something, you know, right. it stimulates a response, and bang, off we go. We are always, with the best intentions, responding in a certain way. Right. What would be your biggest tip for people to counter that, to stop that? Really get in the habit of monitoring your behavior every day. And after a while, you start to see patterns. When this happens, it produces a negative response. In the book, I talk about there is a trigger. The trigger produces a response. Excuse me, there's a trigger, leads to an impulse, leads to a behavior. The whole idea of the book is there's still going to be triggers. And you're still going to have an impulse. This is not the feeling police here. You have the right to feel every one feel. <laughs> On the other hand, to get you to become aware of the trigger and the impulse, you think, wait a minute, this happens. It's led to this reaction. Mm -hmm. My instinct is to do that, but that's not who I want to be become aware, and then realize I have a choice, and then behave in a certain way. The example I use in the class is, uh, I got an email a few months ago from a young man and said, thank you for the help you gave me years ago. And He said, yesterday my wife called and she was having a hard day, and I was under a lot of pressure. I was just getting ready to point out you know, how her problems pale and significant to my own, and then all of a sudden I remembered your class, and I stopped and breathed, and I said, I love you, thank you for all the sacrifices you made for the family. I spent 25 bucks and got her some flowers. It was the best 25 bucks I ever spent. Thank you. Well, that's the whole idea. Breathe, become aware, then act. Right. And it's funny, whenever I'm driving in a car, I always think about what you said. Yeah. And I love it. So anyway, uh, some great tips there today. Thank you so much for your time. Thank I look you. forward to seeing you again, spending more time with you soon. Rebel Networker.